To get started, I just added a video clip to my timeline that I'd like to change the color of. Let's begin by creating a new adjustment layer by right-clicking on the project panel and going to New Item Adjustment Layer. Then drag your adjustment layer above your video clip on the timeline. Next, go over to the Effects panel and type Tint into the search box. Drag the Tint effect onto your adjustment layer on the timeline. Make sure your adjustment layer is selected and then go up to Effect Controls. If you only want to change your video to a single color, changing the Map White 2 will usually look the best. Reduce the amount of tint if you want a more subtle effect. If you want a different, lighter looking effect, change the Map White 2 back to white and change Map Black 2 to a different color. To create a multicolor blended tint, just change both colors. Now this looks good, but the reason I added the adjustment layer earlier is because it allows you to change the opacity's blend mode for your tint. This way you can create interesting blended color effects if that's what you're going for. Finally, if you want to animate your tint in and out, start by moving the time head to where you want to begin showing your tint. Click the stopwatch next to Amount to Tint to create a starting keyframe. Change the amount to tint to zero. Then move the time head to where you want your tint to be fully shown by. Increase the tint to the amount of your choice to create a second keyframe. Then move the time head to where you want your tint to be removed by and change the amount of tint back to zero to create a third keyframe. Okay, and now my tint goes in and out. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.